Hey y'all, so I decided to vlog something today. It might be random and a little all over the place. Yes, I'm in the bathroom. Um, I've decided to turn on the camera and try to vlog a little something for y'all. I'm about to get into the shower, brush my hair, maybe throw it up, do something with it try to get myself up and going to clean this house. I need to do my laundry really bad. I did my son's laundry last night and I need to get them out the dryer. They've been in the dryer since last night. Um, I'll get them folded and put away also. And yeah, I'll show you a little bit of, of my day today. Um, Fuller came to visit yesterday, so I'm really not feeling well. I'm not doing that with my hair, y'all. I'm gonna brush it, I'm gonna throw it up, but I'm about to get in a shower now and go wash because it's bad, y'all. Sorry if it's TMI, but I'm an open book. <laughs> so yeah, uh, let me go get in the shower and I'll see you in a second. Girl, I see your face everywhere. When I'm going out, you'll be there. Cause everything reminds me of Okay, y'all. I feel better. Girl, I think I'm losing my mind. Try to go to work, but I lost track of time. Cause everyone keep looking like you. I can't take no more. I miss your touch from your hands and your body. So much to think of you with someone else. Can't get enough when you're sweet talking to me. Now I'm talking sweet all by myself. Yeah. Y'all, the stuff these kids listen and watch on <sighs> So, I showered. I'm clean. Everywhere that matters. Oh, I know you want me to sleep. Do you want grilled cheese with it? Okay. Bye bye. Do you want grilled cheese, tomato soup with sissy? No, of course not. Don't you like grilled cheese and tomato soup? I mean, not that much now. Well, you should eat it. It's a nice lunch. You gotta eat something for lunch. He's like, I'll just wait for dinner. Really? So, I'm just, I'm singing Jung Gil. It's that time. I just heard this song. I ain't going nowhere. I don't have no visitors. So, yeah. I guess I'll show y'all how I make my grilled cheese. I don't use butter anymore. I use my mayo. So I kind of wanted to mention something. My thingy. What? 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 And say something about this YouTube reactors, man. I've been following around with, um, with one certain one, um, and I watch the women mothers, and they react to. And I just find it so funny that they talk so much crap these mothers right and they say this and that and whatever and then this better not be burned. and they say these moms don't do this or that or feed their kids this and that and then the moms come out later on that night or the next day <laughs> after the talking ish posting what 
supposedly, you know, what they do or feed their kids and what they do for their kids and that these so-called reactors, you know, say they don't do. Boy, I'm a hot mess. And the part that killed me the most today was when a certain reactor, oh, sorry, I just, and there's one of the moms now that I watch. She just posted. Um, I think it's so funny how this reactor is talking about this one mom. Or this one woman that she very so much hates. Okay. And a certain woman has a new man in her house. Because she saw shoes hanging off the couch of this woman's house. Come to find out the shoes is the woman's daughter. Now the certain reactor claims that she watches these videos. She takes notes. She writes things down. But yet, she doesn't watch the whole video. She said because these women and these moms are so boring that she can't watch them all. So she'll skip like half, like 30 minutes of it. Yet those are the half or the 30 minutes that you're skipping that you end up talking about because you skipped it and don't know nothing. How are you taking notes on these certain women that you claim to hate, you constantly talk about on the daily because you can't talk about anything or anyone else how you gonna skip half their content and then supposedly take notes and then talk, make a whole reaction video talking about them and claiming to know so much. Like you don't know nothing about these people. You see what they show you, what they want you to see and they don't show what they don't want you to see. And how are you going to speak on a video that you yourself say all the time that you skip 30 minutes of? You, how are you taking notes? You can't take notes on someone in a video if you're not going to watch the whole thing. And you claim that these two moms, because there's two, you claim they're so boring, okay, that you don't watch them at all anymore. But you do. You watch them. You watch their Instagrams. You watch their videos. Obviously, they're not that boring to you. I don't know, y'all. It's weird. Now, I can see having a re being a reactor and having a reaction channel to actually, like, react on important matters. Not just talking crap on people and how they live and what they look like or what their weight is or how they weigh their hair or how they take care of their children. Justify all you want. That is not reacting. That's just hating and bashing. Reacting on a certain someone or topic is not even talking about celebrities. Like you, you gotta react and like spit out facts about something that's actually important. Hating and bashing and constantly talking about people just because you don't like them and you know you cannot stand them and the way they live. That's not reacting. That's just bashing. I don't care. They, this one mainly, she tries to um, justify herself in like so many ways. But there's no justification for all this hate and women bashing. Like, and these people going around saying this and that, spreading, you know, rumors or whatever on their channel and on their reaction channels. And then here comes, you know, the video of them doing exactly what you thought they weren't doing because you couldn't wait to keep your mouth shut. And, you know give them time to post their content that you say that they don't do or they don't feed or whatever. What? It's like some smoke or something is coming through my kitchen. Like through the window. I guess it's just the cool air. I don't know y'all. 
I guess it's just the cool air. I guess I'll make my sandwich. But yeah, like, I love it. Like, I just think it's so funny watching them talk all this mess on these freaking women. And then the women post exactly what the reactors were talking about. Talking ish about that they supposedly don't do. Like, hey, I do do this. You know, I mean, most creators post like once or twice a week. And vlogmas just ended, so they're not going to be posting every day now that vlogmas is over. You know? So they're going to go be going back to their once or twice a week posting. But honestly, I don't know. Like, I know these reactors don't even care. They think they can justify everything that they hate and bash and talk on. And it will never. And the only reason why you reactors channels have all the subscribers and the views that you have is because people love drama. People love gossip. People love to hate. You take all the negativity and the bashing out of your channels post you one regular content video of you cleaning your house of doing laundry or something and i guarantee you you won't get no views it'll drop or you just if you ever don't make it about hating and bashing it'll drop if you end up not being a reactor channel one day in the future because it'll get boring not talking ish about people. It's honestly ridiculous. But they won't. And they don't even show their face. Half those reactors do not show their face. They might put like one little picture up. But they don't show their face. They don't show their home. Because they want to act and seem to everyone else. That they're these perfect women. Perfect mothers. They look perfect. But they won't show their perfect, they won't show their perfect house or their perfect hair or their perfect body. How they keep their perfect skin color, and, you know, whatever. Perfect hygiene. I did subscribe once to this one certain reactor. I did like her in the beginning because one of the certain moms was starting to get on my nerves. But then I ended up unsubscribing and going back to the other because honestly, the one mom I went back to seems more real than this reactor. And honestly, she's just more interesting than watching the reactor. Because the reactor is boring just talking about the same women all day, every day. You have no other content but to talk about the same women all day, every day day like is it not old do you not get tired of talking about the same people putting them down the same words saying the same stuff every day but i guess not what day no bobby don't want to make soup that's right and you know i forgot to tell him he accidentally threw that away you sure you don't want grilled cheese to make soup i'll just have some You can have my sandwich. Mm -hmm. Let me check this. That's all right. Keep it on my side for a little longer. Okay, so here's grilled cheese. I put a little bit of tomato soup right there in that little corner so she doesn't like make a mess of it with a bowl or try to save on some dishes or knock it over or anything. All right, I guess I'll just get him a bowl because all he wants is soup. They also requested something special for dinner tonight because I didn't know what to make, so I let my oldest pick. Not that I want to cook, but you know kids, they got to eat, so you got to cook. Send me a little bit of tomato soup because I'm making me one. I want a little bit of tomato soup. All right, Bubba, come get your ball. Yes, Bubby just wants tomato soup. Here's yours, sis. Yeah, you say that until I find stains on the floor. Oh, no, I might just have me one. I don't know. 
I really didn't even want this myself, but if I have to make it anywhere, I might as well make me one. All right, baby, go eat. I can't wait to do me some laundry. Cause we're out of towels for the bathroom. Daddy's at work. Yep, Daddy's at work. Oh, I know this is dark, but I like this lighting right here. You'll see how bad I look. Y'all, Aunt Flo was rough today. I took two ibuprofen. I'm waiting for my ibuprofen to kick in. It just feels good to sit down. I'm hot. It is hot. Are you hot, sis? She's not even listening to me. I'm opening this window, too. Crack it. My living room is a wreck. Oh, my God. The air from outside feels amazing. It's supposed to be like 57 degrees. I mean, it's still a little chilly. I feel like 57, but... So, I'm going to try to start vlogging more for y'all. I have ideas. You know, not really ideas, but content I have been wanting to put out and post. But I just haven't felt like it. I just haven't had the time or just... And now my period hit me today. I just don't... I'm not feeling the best. I'm so bored, y'all. We don't go nowhere to do nothing. I'm gonna put this stove. Leave this out in case they want more. Put up this one. I know I will be vlogging this weekend at my aunt's um, for a late Christmas dinner. Kind of New Year's Eve dinner now. But I will be vlogging for that. What? It's burning my eyes. You want the sun? Yes. Give me the milk. Go eat. All right, it's good enough. I'm hungry. Just gonna pop it on my cutting board so I can cut it in half. I need to hurry up and eat so I can get some of this laundry and stuff done while the ibuprofen is working its way and working my pants. Oh, hot, hot, hot. Oh, it's been so long since I make grilled cheese. It's so good, but I just never feel like making it. Look at my hair. Good job. I'll see you when I'm done eating. Just text, I know it's a toss Oh, but I hate the fact that we lost such a The Uber pulling up on call Tell me as you trying to fall through I'ma leave it up to you What you wanna do? Look, I'm trying to spend this time with you Know we overdo what you're doing right now, right now Baby, won't you swing my way? It's been a day and I've been thinking all loud I know I want you Long time since the last time Got a tab, we could run up Knew you from the way, now we grown up My look, yeah, made the realest one's nervous But if you want it, tap in I think that I know some word If we could go to crash land We could keep the pace on slow jam Don't leave me on red Can we go back where we first began? No plans, all we have is the moment Now I'm paid by the sentence Taking my time with it Baby, give me yours So I could get some butterflies trapped in your rib cage. Let me know we on the same page Hit me with a text voice, note or an emoji 
emoji waiting on day for your name on the ID. Y'all, it is so hot. Let me tell you, menopause is real. Okay, yes, I'm only 34, but I'm dying. Like, I, 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 all I have to do is like do some laundry or dust or just vacuum once. I'm sweating to death. death. Mm-hmm. No, we're not keeping it. Mm-hmm. 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 My own mother more grilled cheese into my soup, so I just got done making that. Now I'm getting her some chocolate milk made as she likes. So I just got done watching Live Life. And point again proven, <laughs> these reactors don't know nothing. They really don't know nothing. I'm not saying I do, but I mean, I at least wait to the videos come out. See if the certain videos come out that these reactors speak on. And it did. It came out. And then the one reactor said that Liv probably got all her kids toys from Five Below. And she didn't. She went to Walmart in some other place. Toys for Tots or something like that. Yes, Daddy. You said chocolate mix. But yeah, like I said, like these reactors are so goofy. They think they're putting out like info and facts and they're not because the facts don't come till after their video and they're talking crap. Let me put you up here because I gotta put some dishes in the dishwasher and I need to write down this counter. Now, I'm not saying that they never have facts on anyone or anything or they never get facts at all. But like, probably 96, 97% of the time, it's BS. They don't know nothing. So yeah, I just want to speak on that. And say what you want about it. I don't really care. All right. I had to work down this counter. I tell y'all, even just making some grilled cheese and tomato soup, it's a whole mess. I'm gonna grab this with my hand. Oh my god, I cannot stand these rags. This is like not very wet, which I mean, I don't like them like dripping in the soap, but it's pretty dry. Clean as you cook, y'all. Clean as you cook. Which I was, and then I had everything pretty much up, cleaned up, but they wanted more. It smells good, though. These wipes really smell good. I haven't had this brand before. It's called Fresh Scent Disinfecting Wipes. They smell so good. It's clean, like laundry clean. It smells really good. wipe down. I don't think anything's dirty over here on this counter. This stuff smells really good though. I'm gonna drink some water. See these clothes are done washing yet. Nope, I hear them. They're still going. I'm gonna sit down for a minute. I feel so good to sit down, y'all. When is that time of the month? And you're just, you know, going so heavy and I love my bed. 
This is so comfortable. I've been slacking on the water, y'all. I'm trying to get back on it. Water only. I don't drink nowhere near as much as water, you know. Nowhere near as much water as you're supposed to drink. But I'll get there one day. I'll get there. I want to look for like a good... I don't really like the plastic tumblers. Because when I drink water out of plastic tumblers, my straw just tastes like plastic. And I don't like drinking out of stainless steel, like metal cups because that's all I taste so I'm trying to find me like maybe just a metal straw with a glass um like mason jar type glass or something I don't know they say you drink more water if you drink out of a straw so that's what I want to do I want to find me a nice like tumbler type of cup at the store I think I'm gonna look the boyfriend's at work today. He works tomorrow. And I think this weekend I want to go to one more and go look. Isn't this cute? Y'all, it is so hot. And it's like 60 degrees outside. I got the windows open. You know what? Let me open up my bedroom window. Y'all, it is hot. I mean, the hot flashes. Anyone else menopause in at 34? This window is so disgusting, y'all. Like, we live in... We live in an apartment complex, and I tried telling maintenance men, like, last, or this past summer, that this window was just getting mold all over it. And they didn't believe me. They said it was just dirt. This ain't just dirt. And I can't clean it, because it's underneath the glass. Like, this is freaking mold. I don't know. I know if I email them and they come back here and look at it, they're going to say the same thing. But, like, I want to clean it and I can't clean it because it's underneath the glass. And I don't even want to show you because it's gross, but... Yeah. So, I guess I'm going to make my bed real fast. Let me prop you up over here. This might be a long vlog today, y'all. Oh, my God. I got to show you something first before I make my bed. I am so mad. So I ordered this cute little wooden like boho type of cup I wanted to drink my coffee out of off the sheen. And let me just say, I never like look at the measurements or read measure measurements on anything I order because I don't know measurements. I couldn't tell you nothing to measure in my head or how big something is for my head and just reading it. <sighs> they sent me one cup. I thought it was a two pack. I got one. Look how small this cup is. This, honestly, and the this small, this small. This is how small it is. What am I supposed to do with this? I'm not drinking coffee out of this teeny tiny little thing. I mean, no. What am I supposed to do with this? So I give it to my mom, she didn't want it. Like, what am I supposed to do with it? I don't have no fake flowers or nothing to put in this. I have nothing to put in this. You know what I can use this for? I'm gonna use it for a toothbrush holder. Are you doing? For mine. I have cramps. I don't care, Bobby. Don't argue with me. Put it back. I have cramps. There's boxes in there. I'm so hot. You be quiet in there. My daughter's so mouthy. She's like, you let him ride it for a minute. No. He scuffed the kitchen floor with this bike the other day. I have cramps. Oh my God, the hot flashes. Ugh, oh, the hot flashes. So yeah, I don't know. Maybe I'll just... Honestly, I, I couldn't even use this toothbrush holder because we have electric toothbrushes and it's so light, it'll just tip over. I don't know what to do with this thing. Okay. Can you play Red Wolf? Miss Sang is in her underwear. Look, I'm tea posing. I know you're tea posing. I just had the bug. Got gymnastics this week. Couple days. It's back. It's back. It's in the vlog, I'm tea posing. Maybe you're in your underwear. I'm not sure on the vlog. I lost my legs. <laughs> you're still in your panties.
I know, but they will know that you have no pants. What? No, I see your tea pudding. No, you're the Y'all, I'm so hot. <laughs> it is so hot. Uh, it's so hot. There. <sighs> I told you, you're in your underwear. She don't listen. Yeah. Go play Roblox. Roblox. Bub -bub. But I don't want to play ever again. Well, go tell him he's going to play. Look at your hair. Your hair's on the wrong side. I try. I try. No, mommy said. <laughs> mommy said. I'm so hot. <laughs> <laughs> She's looking at herself in the mirror. <laughs> Being goofy. <laughs> Oh. Stop it! I'm cramping. <laughs> Get up! I know I didn't want that grilled cheese to me soup. Did you fart? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm about to make the bed. <laughs> I love my very first sofa. They know already. Move your hair. It came out, and the two fairy came. They bought your hair. The two fairy came. The two fairy came. <laughs> the two fairy came. All right, you're spitting on me. Ew. Can you stop, Mommy? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> you're just... <laughs> ah! Don't mind her, y'all. I'm waiting on these cramps to go away so I give her a bath. I gotta wash her hair, but they're killing me. Killing me bad. She's had this lingering cough forever, y'all. She's still on antibiotics. She's about done with it. back so it's like hours later <laughs> sorry i am making dinner the chicken just got done in the insta pot i'm letting that natural release for a few i got corn on the cob and then the kids want cheetos at mac and cheese so that is what i'm doing along with also checking my laundry the towels are still wet and they have to be ran again so yeah, I just thought I'd pop here, pop up again, and oh, well, you gotta eat dinner too. Oh huh? uh, yeah, I'll give you some carrots when dinner's done. I'm gonna pickle. Come find me in the night. We both know when it's right. I'm gonna let this natural release probably. And then I'm just going to stick it in the oven under broil to get it all crispy. Nobody eats these pickles. Y'all, this is why I didn't want to cook. I hate waking up over the stove for stuff. But the kids requested chicken on the bone and one of the cob and she was like cheese. I know it's not healthy and not it's processed. I don't care. It's what they wanted, and I had no other ideas of what to make. So kids are kids; they can eat what they want. They can worry about being healthy when they're older. I'm the one that needs to lose some pounds. This oven kind of scares me sometimes. <laughs> it makes noises. <laughs> I hate it, it always sprays up on the blinds. And it's so much to wipe them down. Got 
that in the room. I love my mashed potatoes, but I love the mashed potatoes. I like to use this um, chicken and juice gravy stuff, but it doesn't point. The boys are only got a real small pack of chicken because he doesn't like dirt meat. Though, when we go out to bars and stuff, he eats chicken wings. But he doesn't like chicken drumsticks. I don't know, it's weird. Even when I put sauce on his arm, he won't eat it. He don't like it. So, I will show you plates when it's done. So, I already ate my corn and shooter's mac and cheese, but I forgot to show the plates. There's my chicken. And my sissy, the end. She's already asking for more. And Jasper is in his room eating. Hey y'all, so the rest of the evening after you saw me giving my daughter a bath kind of didn't really work out too well. Um, laundry is still going. It's like five minutes till midnight, so I'm not even gonna bother vlogging that. Hopefully this vlog, after I edit it, will end up being, you know, long enough. I did not know it was already almost midnight. Like, I didn't know I had my youngest up this late. My son, you know, they're not in school, so I let him stay up and watch TV in his room and everything. He's just been gaming, but I ran the dishwasher, um, what we ate, I ran, you know, I cleaned up dinner, I ran the dishwasher, um, I got my towels dried, folded, put away, I have another load in the dryer right now, it's probably not gonna get folded till tomorrow, tomorrow morning, after my coffee. <laughs> uh, yep, I just got my youngest to fall asleep, she has toys everywhere. Lots of toys everywhere. My couch blankets are a mess. I have my AC on because I'm sweating to death. Let me tell y'all, man, the hot flashes. Like, I really, really think I'm going through menopause. But yeah, I feel like I heard asleep. I'm kind of getting a little headache. I think it's because my hair's been up all day. I think I'm just gonna let my hair down and relax. Nighttime when she's in bed is my me time. My oldest stays in his room, and I sit out here in the quiet. I watch, I, I watch and catch up on my YouTube or I read. So yeah, I'm catching up on my YouTube. And as I was doing the dishwasher earlier, again I was watching more reactors and their new videos. Um, just talking and bashing and calling in other people for them to bash and oh, it is ridiculous how people can't find or try to find any other content besides sitting for hours on the computer or on their phone bashing other women of their own race talking about these other women's skin color and hair and I mean don't take it the wrong way I'm not trying to sound like ignorant or anything but I'm white and I know better I would never be as ignorant and disrespectful to any race making fun of their skin color hair or hygiene I mean I'm not saying I'm perfect at all. I have had my days, I've had times in my life, what have you. Um, I'm the type of person that likes to watch my 600 pound life in the Cotto Avocado on YouTube and just watch them eat and gorge themselves. <laughs> but I mean, I don't know, I don't just, I don't make a reaction channel and bash them and talk about them. Calling them out their name and whatnot. I don't know, it's just ridiculous. I just don't understand it. I really, really don't understand it. So 
so yeah this was day in my life um my evening my teeth are kind of hurting i think i need to just go brush them and i already had my snack tonight so i'm gonna brush them and use some mouthwash or something i don't know could be the weather on and off cold and messing with me too because i do have tmj i was going to mention something but i think i'm going to keep it for another video it's nothing important but yeah, I think I'll just make it another video and then that way I can have like a whole conversation on just that. But yeah, maybe I'll vlog it tomorrow or something. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and go to bed. Um, I need to see if my shows are on actually. Well, I need to hurry and get this edited and whatnot and with my shows on Hulu. But I think the seasons are done, I don't know. I need to check. But, um, um, you like this vlog, I know it's a little bit all over the place, um, probably really will be all over the place editing it, <laughs> but I hope it wasn't too terrible, I hope you enjoy this vlog, if you did like it, please give me a thumbs up, um, I'm new, I'm a small channel, and nobody ever gives me likes. <laughs> Nobody but like one person comments and I never get likes. So it's like, you know, I want to get into the YouTube al algorithm and I know you have to have, you know, your videos got to get a lot of likes. Oh yeah, and I have a Mr. Daddy. Long late. Long late. Oh my lord. Daddy long leg. Sleeping and chilling on my bathroom ceiling above my washer. I know that wasn't important but yeah that's about it um I'll try to vlog again for you tomorrow if not I definitely will the next day I'm so tired y'all I can't wait to watch my shows in peace and just go to sleep sorry about this lighting it is nighttime it is late it's probably about midnight already I only have one lamp in my living room. I do have a ceiling fan light, but I only ever use this one. We never put that one on. Hardly ever. And it's dirty. I never use the fan because I just feel since it hasn't been dusted in a while that if I turned it on, it would just be swinging dust all over the house. So I just leave it alone. <laughs> all right. I'm going to stop rambling. I'll see you on the next one. Bye guys.